In New York City, Prince Harry and Meghan, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, found themselves trailed by photographers as they left a charity event in New York City on May 16th. But this was no ordinary pursuit, according to the couple's spokesperson. They claimed that Harry, Meghan and Ragland were involved in a near-catastrophic car chase by aggressive paparazzi and this lasted for two hours. The statement also said that this chase resulted in multiple near collisions involving drivers, pedestrians and two NYPD officers. Following the incident, New York City Mayor Eric Adams condemned the actions of the paparazzi, calling them reckless and irresponsible. However, police later clarified that the pursuit was relatively short and resulted in no injuries, collisions or arrests. So what really happened? According to an official, in order to evade the paparazzi after the event, Harry and Meghan briefly took refuge at a police station which was about 18 blocks from the ballroom, waiting for the situation to de-escalate. After spending several minutes at the police station, they left in a yellow taxi and this is where Indian origin cab driver Sukcharan Singh comes in. He drove them from the police station and acknowledged that the paparazzi had followed them, but he did not characterize it as a chase. Speaking to Reuters, this is what he said. I was going down 67th Street. A guy in a suit asked me if I was empty and I said yes. A few minutes later, Prince Harry, Meghan and another lady hopped out of a black car into my cab. And as we were going straight, a garbage truck blocked us. All of a sudden, paparazzi came out of nowhere and started taking pictures. They did not stop until the security got out. Prince Harry, Meghan and the other lady were nervous and scared. Now, this incident in New York coincided with another security issue at the couple's California property. A man was arrested for prowling near their residence, raising additional concerns about their safety and privacy. The president of the New York Press Photographers Association criticized the photographer's behavior, noting that it violated the principles of photojournalism and professional ethics. Earlier that evening, Megan had attended a charity event where she received the Foundation's Woman of Vision Award. She expressed her commitment to advocating for the unheard and standing up against injustice. Harry and Megan, who stepped down as working royals in 2020, have been vocal about their struggles with media intrusion. Harry has also argued his safety was compromised due to the absence of police protection during a short visit to the UK in July 2021 when his car was chased by photographers as he left a charity event. The couple have said they funded their own security after former President Donald Trump said the US government wouldn't pay to protect them. NYC Mayor Eric Adams also said, the incident stirred memories of the car crash that killed Harry's mother, Princess Diana, in a tragic car chase in 1997.